Hey everybody, today and the next couple of days, we're going to be working on one of the most important parts of writing an expository or persuasive essay, and that's your thesis statement. And we're going to really talk about why do we write them and how do we write a good one. But what is a thesis statement? Now make sure you have your guided notes out and you're filling this in as we go. Pause if you need to. A thesis statement is that sentence that tells us what you're talking about. It's going to tell us, this is what my main idea is, and this is the order it's going to happen in. It helps you stay organized as a writer and helps your reader know what's coming next so they understand your paper. It's basically the entire paper squeezed into one sentence at the end of the introduction. So it's like, if I had 10 seconds to tell you what my paper is all about, this is the sentence that would do it, right? It's a statement of your topic and the major points you're going to make. Basically, you can use like a math formula. Subject plus claim plus your three points of support. Make sure you're filling this in on your guided notes so you have this to help you later. So, with topic sentences, we talked about using IVF, right? Introduce, verb, finish a statement. So, your subject would be your introduce. Your claim would be your strong verb. And your support would be your finished statement. So you can take what we've used for topic sentences and expand it into a thesis statement. But we want to do that support usually times three is the magic number, right? Three is the magic number. So let's look at this example and see if we can break it down. Going to college involves a complex process that involved researching a school, applying for admission, and enrolling in classes. Can you find the three points of support in this thesis statement? So can we find the subject, the claim, and the three points of support? Look at it, pause for a second. On your guided notes, either highlight or label the three sections. Unpause when you're ready, and let's look at it together. So let's break down the different parts. Going to college is my subject. This whole paper is about going to college, okay? My claim, my strong verb, is it involves a complex process, right? Getting there isn't, you can just go, I'm gonna to go today. It's not how it works, right? And then researching a school, one, applying for admission, two, and then rolling in classes, three, are my three points of support. So I'll have a body paragraph all about how you research a school, a body paragraph all about applying for admission, and a body paragraph about enrolling in classes. Breaks it down makes sense, you know what to write about, your reader knows what they're gonna read about. So now, I'm gonna give you four choices. Which one of these is the best thesis statement? You wanna make sure it has a subject, a claim, and supports. Ready? A, many people go fishing. B, people go fishing for many reasons. C, people fish in order to feed their families for enjoyment and for employment. D, Fishing is enjoyable and can feed families. So, topic across the board is fishing, right? They all have a topic. What is that claim? What is that strong verb? Why does fishing happen, right? And then what are the reasons for it? Your supports are your reasons. On your guided notes, write your best answer. Now you're going to work through some more activities. Thesis statement. It's that big main picture. What is my paper? all about.